Okay, so during the break, I was able to make this patch panel. It's not plastic. I actually grabbed metal because I thought, you know, plastic is kind of stupid. Now, yeah, I know. It's pretty, still pretty half-assed that I'm actually sticking, you know, a piece of metal down here. But I got the fit nice and perfect. I drilled the holes and everything. So, you know, I'll just pop it in with the rivets. You can use any kind of rivets for this, like, you know, these are, uh, blind rivets from, uh, Craftsman, and just use them. I'm actually using them to set up the metal place, so I'm not actually holding it the whole time. Jab them in there. Camera's about to fall. Jab those in there. And we'll do the first two. Pop them in. Cause my hole is a little out of the line over the top here. That should be like two or three pumps, and it'll be popped in. So, There's one. Now what I'll do too is to keep other things from rusting. I'll shoot some undercoating. On the top of the, on top of the thing under this, so I'm gonna change my blade for my, my fit. Fix that, but I'll do that in a second. Let me just put this one on. Look, the rivety didn't even go through. I'm going to have to drill it out and put in a new one. Son of a bitch. But, that's all for today, guys. So, until, I don't know, this weekend, we're going to make brackets for my uh, slide hammer. Pull out that lower radiator support that was busted. Sound like fun? Alright, well, see you on Saturday, people. So I didn't want to leave you guys hanging. I thought, you know, that's all for Saturday. But you know what? I had some time. This is what I did. Here's the JB weld. This is the JB quick weld. It, it dries in, you know, four minutes. But really, ten minutes to a full heart. So this is what it looks like. Then I'm here. I'm going to lay down some undercoating. Just to cover up the metal and everything else. And you know what? Might have one day where we'll paint this. You know, because it's pretty nasty. So pretty much all for now.